The Fanatec CSL Elite pedals with load cell have to be the best value on the market for a pair of pedals that come with a load cell. But if there's one disadvantage to these pedals, it is the fact that when it comes to braking, it can be slightly unsatisfactory being that there is no way to customize the pedals in its travel other than only three dampeners. But with BBJ's new mod, that you're able to do that now. So let's see if it makes a big difference and consider the BBJ mod. So let's take a quick look then at the dampers and see the difference in the way they look and the hardness of the dampers themselves. So we'll start off with the softest which is the brown dampener. This is relatively similar to the stock damper that you get in the pedals from Fanatec themselves. So if you're looking for just a replacement for that, this is definitely a go-to straight away. Unfortunately, I don't have a way of measuring the strength of each dampener, so I'm having to use goat science, which are my fingers. But you can tell straight away how soft the brown one is in comparison to the rest that we'll see in just a second. Now, moving on to the blue dampener. Now, this isn't uh, a foam damper, but to me, in my hand, it felt the softer one out of the green, even though in the pedals, you can definitely see the green compresses more. But it is slightly softer than the 65 kilogram. So if you wanted something that is lighter than 65 for your initial braking phase, this is a great one to put in as I, what I've done in my pedals. Moving on quickly then to the green dampener, the foam one. Now if you, like me, liked a slightly softer initial braking phase when you're driving in your sim, this one is fantastic for that. Because I use socks, I don't, it's dry, uh, I don't brake especially hard. But with this, I'm able to slightly push the brake, giving me that squidgy feel at the beginning, just so I can apply the brakes, brake slightly if needed in a corner. So this is fantastic for that, being able to do this. Moving on to the yellow dampener. You can see in my hand how hard I'm having to push now to be able to get the force for these dampeners to start to move. BBJ say that this dampener is 70 sure, so you can really tell by pushing this, but this is where you'll start to able to customize even further how you want the pedal to feel because it's slightly heavier than the 65, but nowhere near as strong as the 85, given that you're getting the increments rather than jumps. That's the reason why I put one of these as well in my pedals, to give me that progression feel on the pedal, which it really does help with. Now, onto the red dampener. So to me, this red dampener feels heavier than the 85 that came with my pedals. It is not as strong though as the 95 uh, with the Fanatec, which is the strongest that they come with, which is pretty much solid rubber at this point. But it's something that if you want the pedal to have less travel at the end of your braking, you can shove one of these in and it will give you that feel for sure. And once again though, allowing you to customize this even further to how you want it to feel. Also in this little pick package they sent you, they give you some silicone grease to put around the rubber dampers uh, to possibly stop wear so they're not chafing against each other causing uh, dust basically to come from them and excessive wear. I personally have not used this as I'm only using three dampeners in mine from them uh, but I just suggest that if you're a heavy breaker and you use a soft dampener this is probably a good thing to just put around the edge or the face of the dampener to be able to get them to not chafe as much against each other which was obviously the intention of this but it's something that I've not done as I'd rather not get my fingers covered in silicon while touching my pedals. Final thoughts then on the BBJ mod, because it's quite a simple mod. Uh, does it work? Absolutely. If you are looking to customise the brake so you're able to get a squidgy feel at the beginning and have a more progression feel on the pedal, it definitely works compared to the stock that you get with Fanatec being that it's only 65, 85 and 95. Having the smaller increments helps so much to define where you're braking and how you're braking. Uh, you can see in the video of me using them how much compression I'm getting on the green damper being that it is foam. And you can see that the blue one is compressing more than the yellow obviously being 
a different type of uh, or a different short of rubber but like I said definitely works pick them up if you want more dampeners to add to your kit for more customization because who doesn't want more customization in their pedals in their sim gear because we know we all love tinkering with our rigs well I hope you found this helpful guys this is Billy Goat Boy signing out see you guys on the track